The Brit X B Lively falls in between lightweight and full size strollers at 20 pounds. And at $260, it has a great price point. This price includes the car seat adapter, so it will handle infants and children up to 55 pounds or 44 inches tall. It folds with one pull using one hand. Unfolding is also easy once you've released the latch. It's bigger than many strollers when folded, but still fits easily in a small trunk. The storage basket is bigger than that on most strollers, but you have to bend down pretty far to get to it. We like the compartment up top for smaller items and the pockets for cup holders. The peekaboo window offers some ventilation as well as visibility. It has a solid foam covered handle fixed at 39 inches high, which is a typical height. The brake pedal is very reliable and comfortable to release, even with bare feet. The harness straps take some fiddling to adjust, and they have to be re-threaded to raise the shoulder height. The buckle button is stiff to push, and the clips aren't as easy to use as some others. The seat reclines and raises easily, and lays back at a good napping angle. The seat opens in front, but doesn't stay up as a leg rest. We compared ride smoothness, and the Be Lively has one of the least bumpy rides. In part, that's because of the large wheels and all-wheel suspension. While it's easy to push going straight, it requires more force to turn than some strollers because of its overall length. So it's great for walks, but not so much for lots of maneuvering. It does a little better off-road than some strollers we tested, but still not great. But it handles the grass easily and doesn't veer when pushing straight. The seats are reasonably padded and comfortable, although it doesn't sit as upright as we would like. The canopy is large and it offers pretty extensive sun protection. You can buy a kid snack tray and cup holder separately. The Be Lively has a sturdy frame and high quality materials like other strollers made by Britax. In our sound testing, the Be Lively had a very low average decibel level reading. We didn't find any pinch points that concerned us. It was less likely to tip over sideways than most other strollers in our tip over test, although its width makes it a little less maneuverable going through small doorways. Here's a quick list of what we like. Easy folding, nice storage, size for big kids, and we don't like the less agile steering and the bulky folded size. Overall, a highly recommended stroller. If you like this, please like and subscribe.